How are you today? Finding yourself. You have been receiving treatments of what we call platelet-rich plasma therapy. Yes. For a wound that you've had for how long? Since 1997. So you figure over 10 years. And what other treatments have you tried over that 10-year period? Over the 10-year period, I have had oh, de debridements three to four times a week. Um, Silvadeen, honey enriched uh, treatment, it's just all kind of treatments. Um, even where I've had to have elastic bands put on my legs every day to keep the swelling down and to keep the wound from, uh, and also multiple dressing changes a day because it seeps and uh, drains so bad. So tell me about the pain you were having during this time. Oh, the pain with the wound has been excruciating. It's been to the point to where I've had to increase my pain meds from taking one or two pain pills per day to taking the maximum up to six doses of medication per day just to try to maintain. What the pain. types of medications were you taking for pain? Oh, I've taken um, whatever I thought would relieve the pain, anywhere from Tylenol to Tylenol PMs to um, Norco, Ultram whatever I thought would help. Unbelievable. And how long have you been receiving our treatment of platelet-rich plasma? I've been receiving the treatment for three or four weeks now. Okay, and this wound has done extremely well compared to before. When was the last time this wound looked like this? Uh, this wound has been open since 1997, so I haven't, it hasn't been healed since. Prior and it has made enormous, enormous progress. Yes, it has. From now to then. So what about the pain? We've given you PRP treatments to address the pain as well. How's your pain now? The pain has subsided tremendously. I'm, I have no pain now. I honestly have no pain now. When I began the treatment, um, I was still having some pain, but now it has subsided totally. Were you ever recommended or was amputation ever suggested? Amputation was suggested by a vascular surgeon because I also suffer with lymphedema and that was the first thing that he told me is that um, due to the wound and in which the uh, way the wound looked that later on I may have to have an amputation. And today you will receive, will receive your third treatment? Yes. And I, it looks as though this wound is doing extremely well. It has. And I'm confident that within the next few weeks, this should be a closed chapter as far as this wound is concerned. And I'm very excited about that. Excellent. How are we doing today, Miss Tuck? Great in yourself. You have been through a lot with this leg. Yes, I have. And today, we're going to say that this wound is healed. Yeah. And you've had this wound for how long? Since 1997. And today happens to be Valentine's Day. Yes. On top of that. Yes. And are you taking any more pain pills? No, I haven't taken pain pills since December prior to coming to see you. And you've been receiving what we call platelet-rich plasma. Yes. And I'm very proud that uh, we have healed this wound, something that you have suffered with for so long. Yes. Has the quality of your life improved? Yes, it has. And what it really have? I'm able to stand longer. I'm able to interact with my daughters. I'm able to um, do things I wouldn't normally do. As a matter of fact, Sunday, I wore a short dress to church. I haven't worn anything, a dress in, since 97 because of the appearance of my leg. So I was able to wear a dress to church on Sunday and not be embarrassed by, um, by my leg because it's healed as well as the swelling has subsided tremendously. Hallelujah. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank All you right. so much, Dr. Uh, Rutherford. Thank you now. This is fantastic. This is completely healed. And go ahead and uh, make sure those dresses are not too short. Now. <laughs> okay. Okay, now thank, thank you. you. Bye -bye. Bye.